Yeah, my, it's me Pierre. Welcome in the new video. <laughs> Welcome on my channel. First of all, thank you so much for our new subscriptions. Uh, yeah, it's nice to see more people, more and more people actually, who subscribe to the, to my channel. And yeah, that's really, really nice and good. So uh, yeah, uh, what can I say? There's always something have to happen, has to happen to me. Uh, sometimes positive, sometimes negative. So I'm gonna tell you a little bit story that just happened now. But first of all, Nicolas cannot go there. Yeah, I need to watch out because he is like uh, he's with me and he's trying to climb up. So first of all, I'm going to show you the progress of a train station like like from time to time I'm doing. Yeah, yeah, it's going quite fast, quite fast. Very good. Very good. There is a, a visible progress on it. So uh, yeah, this is how it looks like then. Beautiful view on the KLCC over there. Cannot see, probably it's raining. So yeah, let's go for a walk then I can record the video tell you what's happened just now because yeah it's just like oh, my blood pressure just go up and yeah i love the i love the answer from the phone and from the people i don't care it's not my problem <laughs> so let's go so the situation is my par my, my parcel my wife ordered a parcel is quite big but anyway the 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 thing is that whole standard procedure proce <laughs> I can't even talk. <laughs> okay, so how does it work? So usually they will, of course, the delivery people will call you first, okay? Or they will send you a message and blah, blah, blah. So I was at home, easy to pick it up my parcel, no problem to go down, it's gonna take one minute to go down, pick it up the parcel, he can go, I'm happy, he's happy, everything, everyone is happy because he delivered, I received, and everything is like done how it's supposed to be. So I was sitting at home and I just checked the phone. No call, no message, no nothing, just simply one picture showing that uh, uh, my parcel was delivered but actually I don't know where is it because the picture that they're doing you cannot see uh, where they deliver and overall we have like a pop box you know if you if you cannot go pick it up uh, then you can always ask them to, to leave the parcel in the pop box most of the delivery people that come into our like a condo they know what to do yes you can go to the playground but it's wet so watch out so usually they will just put it to the pop box okay so no problem they will send the message okay i can go down pay for my parcel blah 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 sometimes you need to pay sometimes no it's depend how long you're gonna keep that parcel in your in a pop box but anyway <laughs> the whole situation was i just get the message that the parcel is delivered but i don't know where is my parcel so of course i have to look for a parcel and it turns out that my parcel is at the kiriman which is Okay, to those who are uh, from outside the Malaysia, oh, yeah, it's wet. It's it's quite wet, Nicolas. It's dangerous. Cannot play. Uh, it's wet. Everything is wet. Yeah. So basically, I have to find my parcel by my own because the person who delivered the parcel, he didn't like uh, answer the phone. He didn't uh, answer my messages because I just normally ask ask him where did you put my parcel? Where is the parcel? Where I can go pick it up? Since you already pressed it like a, I mean. Uh, send me a message that the parcel is delivered but i didn't know where is the parcel so of course i messaged him first to ask him where is it blah 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 it turns out is that kiriman kiriman yeah is the person who collect the parcel it's like a private one you can uh, send your parcel over there then they're gonna keep that parcel for you for maybe few days few hours it depends from you then you have to pay like a silly money like a one ringgit maybe two ringgit depend from the parcel depend how long and things like this so I had to go to the Kiriman because Kiriman sent me a message that I have your parcel. So of course the biggest problem was why first of all he, they sent the parcel to the Kiriman which I didn't uh, basically ask for it because I was waiting for the parcel. I can go down, I can go pick it up. So of course that is like a small problem to solve but the problem is that of course you have to pay and I don't mind to pay one ringgit, two ringgit for my parcel but first of all when I asked the person who deliver why the parcel is here uh the, the 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 courier he said to me i don't know i don't care i don't know your parcel is over there because i live it over there so that was the first thing yeah you cannot go out because it's wet yeah so we have to go around so so of course the first what i hear like i don't care parcel is over there and blah 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 then i start to think like uh, what kind of attitude is like this it, it's just really really wrong that's why my blood pressure go up first then i went to the kiriman and of course he said to me i cannot take the parcel if i'm not gonna pay one ringgit so of course i said it's not my why, why I, uh, I can pay you but why you didn't check even the parcel because usually if you want to deliver to that kiriman they should put the address of a kiriman and then only they can send the parcel over there because 
because if not then how can you know where is your parcel how can you know by basically where to go where to find you know that was a situation that actually once um, especially that there is a shopping mall and the kinemon sometimes it's closed sometimes it's open because they always complain that they don't have a uh, manpower to run this uh, to run this business which is which is strange but okay and but the thing is that once uh, i went down over there <laughs> the pla there is a place where i cut my hair and the parcel was in front of a uh, like a doors and this is a shopping mall there's a lot of uh, people coming in coming out and blah 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 walking around they can they they just can take any simple parcel so that's why i was like a little bit pissed off because they said that the guy who ruined the kiriman he said to me i don't care it's not my problem call to this guy and of course one blame each other second one blah 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 then i say i'm not gonna pay you I'm just gonna cancel the parcel you can take it you can do whatever you want because this is a silly answer especially that they see you and they like are telling you the the two different two two words that really like uh, make me angry I don't care not my problem do what you want things like this you know what I mean so it's like one blaming each, each other which is which is silly so of course that <laughs> it's not the fault of a Kiriman well, a little bit because he's supposed to check the parcel especially that there was a lot of the cases that people complain about the same thing that they have to look the parcel go around the towers and look where is the, their parcel second thing of course that is a problem with uh, delivery people but there is only few of them who are causing the problem because 99 percent of the deliveries that i have they go into the pop box or someone gonna call me or sometimes uh, i just get the message oh hi i'm gonna be in the next few minutes can i deliver blah 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 there is a lot of delivery people who do in their, their job very very good basically perfectly they will tell you when they will ask you can you go down and things like this so so i yeah. so, so yeah so this is the whole of a story like i don't understand why why people cannot normally communicate sometimes then you have some kind of a individuals that actually they're gonna make a problem for you and and yeah and and basically <laughs> if the guy like the kiriman guy will not message me that he have my parcel i don't know i would just wait and then basically uh, maybe my wife uh, when she will see um, the statement i don't know she bought it on lazada or shopee or something like this she will probably thinking like oh if it's collected then probably already went down and uh, i collect the parcel and everything then she's gonna like uh, approve but what if, if what will happen if i don't go to the kiriman what if what will happen if for example uh, <laughs> the the parcel will go simply just go under they will leave it on the floor like it's happened a few times already in our like a place then then it's just crazy because my wife will call, like a press like a confirm that everything is done but actually it's not and then actually you know it's it's, uh, it's just i don't uh, sometimes i just simply i just don't understand why people doing things like this why they like i uh, cannot like uh cooperate or do it like uh <laughs> standard thing just message you hi i'm gonna deliver for you can you go down blah 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 things like this even though we have a pop box okay maybe this parcel will not like uh fit in the pop box but still can call i understand that sometimes they um they have some schedule they need to run the business very fast and everything but trust me there is always a time to message earlier like i don't know how it works here about uh some of the people really like uh just don't care it's not it's not the first time that something like like this happen but uh basically everything i would just don't bother here yeah? i would just don't make like a problem i would just don't even make a video about this but when i hear the words i don't care it's not my problem the second guy saying i don't care it's not my problem then whose problem it is <laughs> this is just crazy well i received a parcel but uh yeah this is just silly what they doing and yeah anyway that was the story that i want to share with you <laughs> yeah, so let me know in the comments what do you think about this um i don't know it's really just don't understand why they just don't <laughs> cannot follow some rules anyway that's a very short story about this what's happened to me uh now will be a little bit different few me i mean i'm talking about the next few days because of uh we're gonna have like uh some holidays deeper valley is coming so maybe there will no there, there 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 that way no that way that way so we will have like uh some of the time for us so so i i mean some time for us uh there will be some like a few days off i think thursday is a is a is a public holiday then my wife have a friday off so maybe we will uh, go somewhere actually from wednesday my wife have a day off because uh yeah she have a holiday at school so probably we will go somewhere plus uh um what i want to say yeah we're gonna go wednesday to do the passport for this little one for yeah for him because yeah it's time to 
do the passport especially that sooner or later we need to do it because we're going to the Poland for a trip as I mentioned in the last video so that will be interesting so probably next video Wednesday Thursday something like this I'm gonna tell you how it is to make a passport for uh, for my son anyway he's Malaysian so it's easy to do just need to go and depend how long you have to spend over there anyway that will be that's it so thank you for watching for your support uh, for those who watching adverts thumbs up huh? <laughs> yeah finally i will get the payment one cent left but anyway i'm quite happy so thank you for watching have a good day and see you in the next video bye bye